Hey folks, today we're going to be learning about the imperfect tense using the irregular forms of to be, which are essa, and the irregular forms of possa, which means to be able. And so what we're first going to do is we're going to look on page four in our packet. And so you can see the charts here. You can see sum and essa, write them in the present tense over here in Latin and then in English. And then also down below, you're going to write the imperfect forms of to be, uh, in the Latin and the English. Go do that now. You probably want to hit pause on the YouTube video before you get going. So pause. Okay, good. Now that you've unpaused this, uh, you can see the answers. You have the present tense of to be, which is sum es est, sumus estus sunt, it's all review, which is nice. Uh, you also remember that it means I am, you are, she is, we are, y'all are, they are. Okay, the imperfect forms of to be, the past tense, we know are aram, aras, arat, <clears throat> aramis, aratus, arant. And then, so therefore, you also know the translations of those are I was, you were, he was, we were, y'all were, they were. Okay, and so that's the present and imperfect forms of to be. So what we're going to do, we're going to use that as a jumping stone to get to the present and imperfect forms of to be able, which are pasa in the infinitive. Okay, so you can see that we're still keeping the forms of to be in the present and the imperfect, which makes it really nice. And there's going to be a pattern to this. For the present tense forms of to be, watch what happens. So I'm going to add the letters either POS or POT in front of the forms of to be. So we got possible. We got potas. We got potest. Okay, in the plural, we get possumus, potestus, and possunt. Okay, so the stuff in black is what you add on to the forms. Okay, and for the translation, I am in the present tense of to be becomes I am able in the present. Okay, so therefore, possum is I am able. Potest is you are able. Potest is he or she is able. And so on for the plurals. We get we are able, y'all are able, and they are able. Okay, so that's the present tense formation. The imperfect tense formation is very similar. Okay, so we start with a rama rasa rat, and you'll notice that we're going to add a pot to every single form. Okay, so in the singular, you get potaram, potaras, potarat. And the translation is I am able, you, excuse me, I was able, you were able, she was able. Okay, again, in the plural forms, it goes potaramus, potaratus, potarans. It, we were able, y'all were able, they were able. Okay, so you can see the forms, potaram, potaras, potarat, potaramus, potaratus, potarat, for the imperfect forms of to be able, and then up here in the present forms, posum, potest, potest, posumus, potestus, posunt. Okay, I am able, you are able, she is able, and so the rest you guys are good on. Okay, there is one pattern to help you guys remember. Okay, notice if there is an S in to be, so like sum, sumus, sunt, then there's an S in the form of possum, okay, or possa, to be able. If there's a T, okay, uh, 
it comes before an E. Okay, so here's the mnemonic that uh, another class came up with years ago. If there's an E into B, then you gotta add a T. Okay, and so notice, because all of the imperfect forms of to be, a Rama, Rasa, Ram, and so on, notice all of the forms start with an E, therefore, that's why there's a P-O-T in front of all of them. So that should really help you out. Uh, good luck on your assignments on this. If you have any questions, certainly let me know.